Hi, and welcome back to this week's video. So this week I really didn't know what I was going to make. I was fresh out of ideas and I, I had nothing. I asked my friend Nicole, I was like, hey, you got any ideas? And she goes, yeah, I have one and I would like to participate. And I was like, okay, let's do it. So we are going to do the tin can challenge, but I'm going to call it tin can roulette because that is more or less what it is. Basically, we're going to go to the grocery store. We're each going to pick out three canned items. We're going to peel off the labels and mix them all up. So we'll have six cans total. You have to pick a can, open it up, take a spoonful, eat it, and swallow it to get a point. If you spit it out or you throw up, no point is given. The person with the most points wins. What do you win? A high five. And a, and a good job, buddy. So we're off to go pick her up and get her done. Ready, ready? No, but yes. <laughs> Cole has gone off to make her selection and I'm making mine. And my first one is Chef Boyardee because that stuff is just nasty. Selection number two, a little bit of canned gravy. The only rule in this is no dog food, no cat food. And nothing with mushrooms because I'm allergic and I could die. There's number three because that just sounds absolutely disgusting. Canned meat. I've got mine. I found her. Has she made her selection? No. <laughs> what you got? 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 Oh, I don't like that. I know you don't like that. That's the whole point. All right, what do we got? We got Hunt's Manwich. Mm. Canned meat. Right on. <laughs> Oh, we've got whole artichoke hearts, mm -hmm. nutritious. <laughs> Some poutine gravy sauce. We're real Canadians. Some beef roni. <laughs> uh, hearts of palm. Don't know what those are, but we're going to find out. One of us will. Yum. <laughs> and everybody's least favorite, creamed rice pudding. Our essential tool of a can opener. Four of them are pull tops, though, so that makes it a lot easier spoon my spoon and the spoon of regret <laughs> let's do rock paper scissors for it winner goes first <laughs> is fire beat rock yes <laughs> i don't think so a rock can't okay, burn <laughs> oh then that means you go first yes i will pick this one in order to get a point i have to swallow and, and successfully eat. Yeah. This one's liquidy. That's cool. Oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, you got the heart of pop. That's what that looks like. I think you're going to have to pull it out with your finger because I don't think you could get that out with a spoon. It smells like butthole, though. It does smell like butthole. Maybe that's why Hurley likes it so much. <laughs> That doesn't look appealing. Do you want me to take the can for you? Sure. So I guess this would be a bite. You can put it back in. You, you're brave. You want to smell that early? Really? It smells like major butthole. <laughs> doesn't taste any better. No point for Megan. All right, your turn. Okay. I'm scared. Falling to this one. Oh no, I got the cream rice pudding. Put it in your Why are you stirring it? It's not gonna make it any better. <laughs> I'm disturbed. Okay. Come on, you got it. Hey, don't eat that. Mm. I mean, the fact that they have cinnamon. Here, I'll take that for you. Cinnamon in it makes it a little bit better, but that was still disgusting. You still got a point, though. She got a point. Uh, if I don't puke it up, I'm struggling. <laughs> My body's like, why'd you do that? I'm going to go with one that I got to use the actual can opener for. Oh, I'm really hoping this isn't the manwich. <laughs> I was really hoping you would get the rice pudding. <laughs> I think this is the gravy question mark? I don't think It so. might be the man witch. I'm not super sure. I think it's the the beefaroni one you got. Well, if that's the case, there's there ain't no roni in it. It's just sauce. It's, it's literally just sauce. 
Maybe that's the bad witch. It's, it's all sauce. There ain't nothing in there. <laughs> I mean, think it's the gravy. No, the gravy would smell like gravy. That well, smells like the tomato. Beef around, I mean, there is no noodles and no meat in here. We'll give it a taste. Let us know when you taste it. <laughs> <laughs> Still no point. Oh, no, I don't like the look of that either. What was it, manwich? I don't know. It tastes like ravioli sauce, but... So then it's probably the beefaroni minus the actual beefaroni. Raw, horrible taste in my mouth. I grabbed this one first, so I guess I'm going with this one. The opener. can opener, yeah. Give crack. I'll take... Can you hold my spoon? <laughs> hold my spoon. Hold my spoon. Your can opener works like a dream. Mine sucks. <laughs> you see, it's quality. It's quality. See, nope, this is the gravy. That's definitely brown. You can't have any gravy. I know it smells good. <laughs> Here's your spoon. Excuse me, sir. You're at one one point and I've got nothing. One spoonful of poutine gravy. Come on! Should be easy. I don't think it's gonna be easy. It's cold <laughs> gravy from a can. It's not easy. I swallowed it whole like medicine, but I did it. It wow. wasn't satisfying though well, as it would hot gravy would be two nothing i'm gonna go with this one what'd you get what'd you get i don't know oh no, no this is the beefaroni so whatever so that... i ate before was manwich why was it so liquidy i don't know man but i did not enjoy gross. it and i really hate beefaroni or anything chef boyardee so i love ravioli from them <laughs> still to this day at least you got a point <laughs> a regretful point but you got a point one point oh no i have the artichoke hearts <laughs> oh oh god oh it's really watery you you Okay. Ew, ew, it's falling apart. I can't even get it out. It kind of fell apart as I pulled it out. This is disgusting. It's really watery. Well, it's hard to show cards. Here we go. You want to smell that first? Yeah, it probably doesn't smell very good, does it, bud? Okay. Bottoms up. Come on, three for three. Three, four, three. Oh, gross. <laughs> There's no way I'm taking a second bite into that because that was absolutely rancid. Don't throw up. Don't throw up. Oh, she's going to throw up. It tastes like, for Canadians, they'll know, in a hot summer's day when you're going through the Tim Hortons drive through when they used to have the outside garbage can, the smell of that sour French vanilla mixed with dirty salt water is what this tastes like. Ew. Did you swallow that? No, I spat it right out. I couldn't even take a she second bite. She gets two bite. points, I get one. <laughs> You're the winner. Yay. All you get is a good job, pal. High five. <laughs> well, you're the winner. It, or at least says high five. No, thanks, Harley. Well, makes it worthwhile. High five from Harley. Thank you for watching. And if you have something you want to see in the future, you leave a comment down below. <laughs> like, subscribe, and hit that <laughs> notification bell. Bye!